CHS is Brian. Hello. Hello. How's it going? Good. Um, are you feeling good? Bad whore. Hello. Please say your name after the tone, then press pound. Peter Peterson. Doctor, feeling good? Cal and Pump, this is Danica. Hello? Hello? How are you doing overall? <clears throat> Who, may I ask who's calling? Drew. Does that Drew. make common sense? Huh. What? Drew Peterson. One second. Are you mad? <laughs> Hello? Who the hell is this guy, Drew Peterson? <laughs> Hello, this is Brian. What do you want from me today? What was that? What is it you got to say that you think is so important? Are you mad? No. I deserve to be treated better than this. You understand what I'm saying? No, I do not. I do not understand what is going on at all. We have a report that the young man says that you rubbed his groceries. No. Yes or no? I have not done any of that. Nobody here that I know of has done anything like that. You know what? You don't have the right to do that. Common sense? You know what that means? None of us did that. I know that your brain is toxic and you can't reason. Uh, this I'm is a sorry big you deal. feel that way. Have a wonderful day. What are you so pissed off about? Clearwater Stop and Go. Hello? Hello? How are you doing overall? Alive? <laughs> I don't know. I live in America. <laughs> I live in let's Montana. Let's get real. If we're going to be real, let's be real. Yeah. How can I help here? I don't know. You called here. Excuse me. Are you gay? You Nope. Um, I'm gay. Well, have fun with that, sir. Have a nice we day. We have a report that the young man says, you jack with me and you'll be gone before you know it. You've reached the food stop. We're not able to answer the phone. Just leave a message and we'll get back to you. Thank you. Hello. You send harassing emails from fake accounts to Greg's uh, cell phone. Why are you in Greg's business? You are breaking the law. Chevron, this is Richard. Hello. Hello, this is Chevron. I I'm just going to give you my opinion. Do you want my opinion? Sure. I'm not sure what benefit you got out of being a drunk pimp. Okay. If you start that druggy crap on me, I will walk your happy ass out of here in two seconds. You understand what I'm saying? You definitely do. Why would I believe that? What? That's me. Uh, show marketplace can help you. Hi. Hello. Can you hear me? I'm sorry? You're really going to have to speak up. Uh, show Marketplace, can I help you? What did you say? What can I do for you, sir? This is the Show Marketplace. Can we have yes, sex? Please. I'm sorry? <laughs> sure. Go. Oh. <laughs> can I get some help, please? Sure. Uh, give me one moment, okay? I'm going to put you on hold. Give me a moment. Yes, I know. That's... Go ahead. Delso Marketplace, I may help you. Hi. Do you remember me? Uh, no. How can I help you? Is that right? Hello? So what's going on? Uh, who is this? How can I help you? This is Miss Childs. Who? This is Miss Childs. You heard me. 
Uh, yeah, how can I help you? You're speaking so softly, I can barely hear you. Oh, I'm pretty, I'm pretty much yelling into the phone. This is regarding... How, how can I help you? My son. I can't find him. Regarding who? My son. Your son? Yeah. I can't find him. Okay, how can I help you with that? Was I've he, got he your son. Store, I'm going to break his fucking neck. What's that? I'm looking up his asshole now. Excuse me? Hello? So what's going on? I'm not sure. You tell me, sir. You're calling the store over here. I'm I would like trying to, to help you, but I don't know what I can son. do for you. What's that? My son. I can't find him. You can't find your son? Yes. It's always that way. Were you... Was he here at our store, or...? Yes. Um, I don't know. There's a few customers in here, but... You understand what I'm saying? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know who your son is. Uh, there's a few customers in here, but there's... I mean, there's really not much I can do for you. Drew Peterson? Yes, sir, but... <laughs> there's... What are you trying to tell me? I mean, there's not... There's nothing I can do. <laughs> what did you That's want me like to do? That's like a dog chasing their tail. It's not ever going to get anywhere. All right. Well, you have a good day. You know what? You're not getting real about this. Okay. Have a good one, sir. What I'm telling you here is you are breaking the law. Fat whore. Sorry. Del Sol Marketplace is not available, record your message at the tone. When you are finished, hang up or press pound for more options. I have been, for a long time, a rotten little bitch. Is that the truth or a lie? Tom and Jerry's. Just wanted to call and remind you, you don't matter. You understand what I'm you saying? Understand? Tom and Jerry. Quit being mad at me and just love me again. Please leave your message for... You've reached Gianna. You understand what I'm saying? Quit being mad at me and just love me again. Hello? How can I help here? Yes. Hello? Yeah. So, how are you doing overall? Doing good. What do you want? Really? Tell me how that's a good deal for you. Quit taking yourself so damn seriously. Hello, this is Shell Gas Station. Can you hear me? Yeah. So, what's going on? What do you want? My name's Fred Herbert. This is regarding... I've got your son. I'm going to break his fucking neck. Chevron Food Mart, may I help you? Hello? Yes, Chevron Food Mart, may I help you? You know what? I'm not some schmo here. Sorry? You are breaking the law. Why are you in Greg's business? Hello? Fat whore. Shell Station, how can I help you? Do you agree that you smoke? What? Hello? Hello? You strike me as a, a really nice, energetic, attractive, intelligent woman. AP14, this is Ashley. I may help you. Hello? Oh. Kathy? Kathy, are you there? Um, I think you're on number. How's it going? Good. Okay. Are you stereotyping people? Tire Pros at North Hills Exxon. Hello? Hello? How's it going? Good.
Good. What can I do for you? I'm just going to give you my opinion. Do you want my opinion? Tire Pros at North Hills Exxon. Thanks for talking to me. Quit taking yourself so damn seriously. Tell me about the fake boobs. Layer security. Hi. What's that? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. You're speaking so softly, I can barely hear you. I can hear you. Do you remember me? I do not. Let's start this again. I went to an AA meeting just yesterday. I got 25 years since I drank, and I was the worst drunk. Where do you work, sir? Wow. Robert, how can I help you? Hello? Hello, IHOP. Thank you for calling. Can you hear me? I'm sorry, excuse me? Can you hear me? I can hear you now. You're speaking so softly, I can barely hear you. I got the magazine. Um, this is IHOP Robinson. How can I help you? Do you remember me? Do I remember you? Yes. I don't remember you. I'm sorry. This is a... Let's start now. this again. You're talking to an older gentleman here who doesn't hear it that well, and... I'm hey, 70 you, teacher, I, I don't, don't know remember you. Are. How can I help you? This is IHOP Robinson. Why are you acting like this? Bye. Call. Hello, thanks for calling Denny's and Pitts. This is Damien speaking. How may I serve you? This is the phone sex department that you're talking with. As I talk right now, I can see the captain bouncing back off the lieutenant, sir. Okay, this is a, okay. This is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. We just received several phone calls from this number, okay? I'm 72 years old, and I've fucked up. So what's going on? I have, hi, this is I have help you. Hi. I said hi. Yes. Are you there? Yeah. You're speaking so softly, I can barely hear you. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Do you remember me? Um... Is this for, like, you want to place an order? Yes. Okay. What did you want to order? I work in a convenience store. Okay. That's what it is. All right. 147 North Euclid Avenue in Upland. We don't do delivery. We just do, like, unless if you want to order online. Excuse me? I said we don't do delivery. Like, I could put in a to-go for, like, a pickup. Right now? Yeah, like, I could put a, or a to-go in for you for pickup, yeah. Please. Huh? Go ahead. Please. You want to put... Okay. So what did you want to get? I went to an AA meeting just yesterday. I got 25 years since I drank, and I was the worst drunk. Okay. Did you... Yes. Did you want to place an order to go? Yeah. Okay. What can I get you? Bacon. Bacon? Yeah. Do you want two or four? Please. D two. Two or four pe Two? Okay. Yes. Is there anything else? Listen to this. I'm 72. I don't know how old you are. I'm just trying to put your order in for you, sir. Wow. Is that right? Yes, that's all. I'm trying to help you so you can put place it to go. I mean, like I said, unless if you're trying to, uh, like, do a delivery, the only way we could do that is, like, you'll have to, like, go through, like, DoorDash or, like, Uber Eats or, like, one of them. Other Hang than on. That, I could yeah. Hang on. Hmm? Hang on just a second. Okay. Okay, I'm heading to my computer here to... See, I'm sitting and typing it into a statewide system. Waiting for their site to come up here. I'm looking at it right here. 
So you just gonna place an order online or? Uh huh. My computer was talking to me. Okay. Hang on. Not everybody uses okay, hold Skype. Hold on, Jerry. I, I can't at the moment. Do you remember me? No, sir. Are, are you placing an order to, for? Yes. Or are you gonna do it? Yes. Okay, so what can, bacon. Okay, so I got your. Yes, I got your bacon for you. Did you want anything else besides the two bacon? Yes. Okay, what else can I get you? Can I get some birthday cake? Some pancakes? Yes. Did you want a, Did you want five or did you want three? Two. Anything else? Yes. Next felon with a firearm? Huh? Yes, I know. That's... Wow. Are you looking at my ad right now? Well, sir, I, I'm trying to put in it to go. That's all I'm trying to do. I'm trying to put this to go in for you. I'm you're wondering what you're you're doing. I'm trying to put the, the to go in for you. Okay. I'm trying to, go ahead. Or I'm trying. Okay, so you, I got your two bacon and then your two pancakes for you. Did you want anything else? No. Okay, your total is five sixty-five. Wow. Well, I'll give you nine bucks. You have to, you pay for it when you get here. I, I don't know how you're going to pay it. You want to spend that kind of money? Oh, you know what? <laughs> Hello. Please leave a message after the tone. Why are you so mad at me? Why are you doing this? Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act? Goodbye. They were calling The Den. This is Vince speaking. How may I help you? Hello. Hello. Do you remember me? Uh, no. Why not? Say again? My name's Fred Herbert. Do you remember me? Fred Robert? Yes. Uh, no, you're going to have to clue me in a little more. Let's start this again. What's that? Huh? Say, say again? There's a lot of things in life that don't make sense. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Yes. Let's start this again. Yeah, what can I do for you? This is some sick motherfucker on the phone. Say again? What? Let's start this again. I went to an AA meeting just yesterday. I got okay. 25 years since I drank, and I was the worst drunk. Okay. So what can I do for you? Can I get a room? A what? Please. A what? Can I get a room? Sure, why not? Wow. Is that right? Whatever you say, man. I'll give you $500. Hey, why don't, why don't you go, uh, I think maybe you better go back to AA. <laughs> okay. I'm 72. I don't know how old you are. Pretty old, pretty old. Not far behind you. I am pretty damn all right. Okay, all right. Well, I you know, we have wait. a good one, all right? When I, I was a, good one. a kid. Yeah, I'll bet, I'll bet. I know, I know. Hello, and thank you for calling the Denny's and Ash, and we'll just be a to-go order. Hi. Yeah. What was that? Yes. What can I get you started with? Mm. Yes. What can I get you started with? Uh-huh. Bacon. Denise and Ashlyn, how can I help you? Why are you acting like this? Who is this? This is Fred. You have the wrong number. This is Denny's, the restaurant. No! Why are you so mad at me? Do you remember me? Hello? Hello? Do you remember me? No, you're calling a restaurant. Yes, I know. That's... Let's start this again. Do you have $2,000? No. Why not? Because we're poor. We work in a restaurant. I've got drugs for sale. Okay, then you can do them. Let me go get my marijuana. Okay. We have some discounts available, but I don't know what you qualify for. Okay, that's great. Uh...
You know, there's a whole long list of them. Hi. Huh? Can you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yes. So what do you want? Cocaine, methamphetamine. Uh... Well, we don't have that here. Well, it would cost you five hundred dollars. I don't. I don't want. I don't want it. You want to spend that kind of money? On what? Cocaine, no. methamphetamine. Uh... Say yes. Started smoking weed in nineteen seventy. I'm seventy two. I don't know how old you are. Okay. You know what? Hold on. Let me get someone that can come to the phone, and maybe they can help you with what you're trying to do. Yes. Go ahead. Bro, go get Austin. Is that right? Wow. Okay. Hello? You heard me. Hello? You're really going to have to speak up. Can you hear me? Yes. What can I do for you today? I've got drugs for sale. You got drugs for sale? Yes. Wow, I can't accept any drugs. Cocaine, methamphetamine, white powder. I think you got the wrong number. Well, it would cost you $500? No, I'm good. You are going to pay it? Nope. Give me $500? Tonight? No. Please. You have a good day, sir. Do you remember me? Um, I don't have to remember you. Let's start this again. Thank you for calling your local Oregon City Grocery Outlet. This is Josh. How can I help you? Hello? Hi, this is Grocery Outlet. How can I help you? I have been, for a long time, a rotten little bitch. I'm just going to give you my opinion. Do you want my opinion? Uh, yeah. You say seven dollars. I deserve groceries better than this. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, let me get you to a manager that can help you. Really? Yeah. Okay, good. Is that the truth or a lie? Hello, how can I help you? What did I do? Hello? What was that? Hello. How are you doing overall? I'm all right. What about you? Good. You strike me as a, a really nice, energetic, attractive, intelligent woman. What you understand what you I'm with? saying? What is it you got to say that you think is so important? I'm sorry, what? Talk to me. Say something. Yes, I'm asking I you how can I help you. I deserve groceries better than this. What happened? You're not getting real about this. We have a report that the young man says that you rubbed his groceries. We what? Enough already with the fake groceries. You understand what I'm saying? No, I have no clue what you're saying. How can I help you? We've done everything we can do. I am totally at peace with this. I don't hate you. I don't resent you. I, I, I don't have any bad feelings or unfinished emotional business with you. Okay. You know what? You need groceries. You need serious, serious groceries. Go and be well. Got to run. Thanks for talking to me. Oregon City Winco. Hello. Howdy, what can I do for you? You and I are going to disagree on some stuff today. I can already feel it. Oh, no. Why are you in Greg's business? Sorry, what's up? You send harassing emails from fake accounts to Greg's uh, cell phone. Sir, this is a, a Winco at Oregon City. You know what? You understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Good. You got a real credibility problem here. Sir, I'm not sure if you realize that this is a Winco store in Oregon City. You're I'm, not I'm getting real about here. this. Why would I believe that? I'm not sure. You can call back. I'll give what you a I'm telling you here like is that. you've taken money from people under fraudulent circumstances across state lines. 
That's a load of crap. Rotten little bitch. Thank you for calling Oregon City, Fred Meyer. How may I direct your call? You send harassing emails from fake accounts to Greg's uh, cell phone. You got one answer, and it's either yes or no. No. Why would I believe that? I don't know, sir. This is a grocery store. We don't. You know what? Else. We've done everything we can do. I am totally at peace with this. I don't hate you. I don't resent you. I, I, I don't have any bad feelings or unfinished emotional business with you. Okay. Okay. Then enjoy your day. What I'm telling you here is there's not a thing wrong with what you just said, and God bless you for claiming that right. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Let's get real. If we're going to be real, let's be real. Ray's Food Place is Susan. May I help you? Hello? Yes? How's it going? Who's this? Dr. Phil. I'm about to hang up. Do you need anything? How can I help here? Okay. Yes. Ray's Food Place is Susan. May I help you? You strike me as a, a really nice, energetic, attractive, intelligent woman. You just seem to me to be like a really nice person. You uneducated moron. Ray's Food Place, how may I help you? Just wanted to call and remind you, you're a bad whore. Do you realize that this is a big problem? Yes or no? I didn't do anything wrong. Good afternoon, Tiger Winkle. This is Paula. How can I help you? How's it going? Good. What can I help you with? Good. So how are you guys doing? Good. What can I help you with? Let's get real. If we're going to be real, let's be real. I deserve groceries better than this. Afternoon, Tiger Winko. You jack with me and you'll be gone before you know it. You crazy bitch, I'm going to take you down. Thank you for calling Grocery Outlet. Heather speaking. How can I help you? Did it occur to you that you can go to jail? Hello? Excuse me? Hello? Excuse, Excuse me? What happened here? What are you talking about? You got a real credibility problem here. You send harassing emails from fake accounts to Greg's uh, cell phone. Mark of the choice, how can I direct your call? Hello? Yes, how can I direct your call? How's it going? Oh, uh, good. How are you doing? Good. You strike me as a, a really nice, energetic, attractive, intelligent woman. Uh, yeah, just minus today, though. <laughs> you just seem to me to be like a really nice person. Okay, uh, do you know who it is? Drew Peterson. Drew Peterson? I'm a grocery man, 58 years old, full-figure divorced. Oh, give me one minute. Those are good groceries, I hope. You know what? Nobody really cares about groceries. Cedar Mill Market of Choice, this is Corky. How can I help you? And just don't think, just start talking. Hello? Hello? How's it going? Doing well. My name's, my name's Corky. How can I help you today? Good. Did it occur to you that you can go to jail? I'm sorry, is this a... Why are you in Greg's business? You send harassing emails from fake accounts to Greg's uh, cell phone. I'm sorry, I have no idea who Greg is. I, I don't think you're calling the right place. This is a You're not story. getting real about this. You got one uh, answer, no. and it's either yes or no. No, thank you. Have a great day. Why are you in Greg's business? You took crystal meth, Xanax, Vicodin, Oxycontin, Adderall, Clonopin, Speed. Hold on. Hello. Hello? Hello? Don't waste my time. Be very careful talking to me. You don't have the balls. Lovejoy's Market, how may I help you? Hello? Hi. So how are you doing overall? Excuse me? What do you want? <laughs> okay. Okay, bye-bye. I'm a drunk pimp. Listen to this shit. Hello, Sandra Marcus? Hello? 
Hello? I got a screwy little uh, woman that just won't fuck me. <laughs> Do you remember me? No. Are you there? You're speaking so softly, I can barely hear you. <laughs> oh! Hello. Hi, John. Hi. You're speaking so softly, I can barely hear you. Uh, yeah. This yeah, is regarding yeah. your son. My son? Yes. Hello? Possession of bestiality. I, I cannot understand. What are you talking about? The bill's $5,000. Your son, he had sex with a minor. My son? Who, who are you? This is Fred. I am Fred Herbert. Yes, yeah, sir. Explain what kind of a dog, Bernie, what kind of a, my son, I don't understand completely. He had sex with a minor. So tell me, what what is what, what happening? I'm a bell bondsman, so I can get away with it. Oh, jeez. Hello? Why yeah, are you acting tell like me this? About what? Why are you Why are you doing this? What do you mean? Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act? Oh, jeez. Who are you? My name's Fred Herbert. Dad, I don't know who are you. My name is Fred Gordon Herbert, oh, and I go by Christ Fred Herbert. Herbert. But some people Why would you go by about Gordon, you? let's say, even though that's their middle name, you know? Do you want to know what the Belvine business is all about? This guy's a terrible girl. You're sentenced and you're in... Wow. Excuse me? Oh, jeez, this guy, I don't know who I, why you call me here? Well, if you don't know, then, then this is uh, BS. Oh, shit. BS Turn on the TV. Son of a bitch, fuck you! Why are you so mad at me? I, I, I don't understand why you're so mad at me, sir. Hang on, LeVar. At the tone, please record your message. This is the phone sex department that you're talking with. As I talk right now, I can see the captain bouncing back off the lieutenant, sir. You do realize that the captain was saying how he wanted to have sex with you, sir. Oh! Tell me what's going on. Thank you for calling Sandy Grocery Outlet. How can I help you? Okay, this is Lieutenant Lascivious for the Cleveland Police Department. Okay. Uh, I beg your pardon, sir? Hello? Uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. Um, not from this number. This is a grocery store. We can't call out on these lines. We just received several phone calls from this number, okay? Um, yeah, this is, I'm located in Sandy, Oregon. We had two calls from this number. Yes, okay, and it was, sir, we have it on tape that, that we had two calls from this number. That's why we called you back. Okay, I well, we're a grocery store in Oregon, and I nobody's been using uh, this phone. They is what? Dial out on them. Say again, sir. I, I'm a grocery store. I can't dial out on these. Uh, lines. okay, sir. We're not mad. We're trying to find out who's calling us here at this district. Yeah, I, I I don't know. I'm just letting you know. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. I this is a grocery store in Oregon, and these lines that I just answered, we do not have the ability to dial out on. We okay. have to use our cell phones to make phone calls. Is what? I have to use my cell phone to make a phone call. I don't have the option of using these lines here. So, and there's only two phones, and we can't dial out on them. You do realize that this is the sex police department that you're talking with? I, I, I'm, yeah, that's why I'm telling you that we, we can't. As I talk right now, I can see the captain's booty bouncing off the lieutenant, sir. Okay. Y'all, y'all got your tape in, right? Okay, let's try this. Thank you for calling Medford Market of Choice. This is Stacy. How can I help you? Hi. Hello. Do you remember me? Today. Uh, this is Stacy with Market of Choice. Are you looking for something? Is that right? Yes. 
Are you oh, calling me? Poor. Oh, this is the business. We didn't call anybody. We no. Gotten, uh... You know what? I've been getting calls all day long that I'm calling somebody, and I'm not calling anybody. Uh, that's what happens with spam people. They actually use your phone number to try to call other people. Wow. Is that right? Yep. Wow. Maybe you should be more prepared for this call. Uh, I, 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 <laughs> I apologize. Okay, well, you have a good day, sir. Somebody has patched us through, Ron. Uh, yeah, so you have a good yeah. day, okay, sir? I'm Don't sorry, call your house you anymore. Okay? Don't call your house oh. anymore. <laughs> okay, sounds good. <laughs> All right. Thanks, sir. Bye. All right, homie. Bye. Hello? Go Foods. I said hi. Hi, Winco Foods. So what's going on? I don't understand. What do you mean? Do you remember me? Hello? How can I, how can I help you? Do you remember me? I don't. Let's Did start I? this again. Yeah. I went to an AA meeting just yesterday. Right now, you're really playing the victim. Oliver Lemon's sister, how can I help Hello. you? Hello. Hello? How's it going? Good. You, is there something I can help you with? Good. Well, let me ask you something. Did it occur to you that you can go to jail? Bad whore. Oliver Lemon Sisters, how can I help you? Be very careful talking to me. What did I do? What is it you got to say that you think is so important? Hello, me, department. Hello? Hello? What is it you got to say that you think is so important? You just seem to me to be like a really nice person. Hello? Hello? How can I help here? I'm just going to give you my opinion. Do you want my opinion? Yes or no? Uh, just one second. Um, hold on. I don't know Hello, anything. Can I help you? Hello? Can I help you? Hello? I deserve groceries better than this. You understand what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, was it a meat problem? Yes. Well, we have meat, a sir. report that the young man says that you rubbed his groceries. I what? You got one answer, and it's either yes or no. I rubbed his groceries. Yes. Can I get a manager for you? Would that be all right? Yes. Okay, hold on one moment. Good. Please. You are a drug addict. J.C. Markia, how can I help you? Hello? Hello? How are you doing overall? Good. How about yourself? Good. You strike me as a, a really nice, energetic, attractive, intelligent woman. Thank you. You just seem to me to be like a really nice person. Thank you. I deserve groceries better than this. You understand what better, I'm saying? Better than what? We have a report that the young man says that you rubbed his groceries. Yes what or no? Mean? I'm going to say no. Why would I believe that? You've taken groceries from people under fraudulent circumstances across state lines. Okay. You and I are going to disagree on some stuff today. I can already feel it. Get over it. You need serious, serious help. Did it occur to you that you can go to jail? Thank you for calling Newport Grocery Outlet. How may I help you? Hello? Yeah, this is Newport Grocery Outlet. So how are you guys doing? We're doing good. How are you? Good. Kathy, are you there? Yeah. How can I help you? Hello? I have been, for a long time, a rotten little bitch. I'm sorry. Does it sound like a logical thing to do? Um, who, me? Yes. 
you got one answer, calling, and it's either yes or no. Why are you, are you asking me if I'm a rotten little bitch? No. Okay, I misunderstood you. What? That's like I a dog chasing that. their tail. It's not ever going to get anywhere. I mean, is that what you're wanting to hear? No, I misunderstood your question. I wasn't sure where you were going with that. What I'm telling you here is I deserve groceries better than this. Okay. Do you, you want understand me to what get I'm saying? my boss on the phone? Yes. Okay. Hold on. Hurry up. Thanks for holding. This is Donna. Identify yourself. How can I help you? Did the Sheriff's Department serve your court summons, dirtbag? I don't have any idea who this is. What? I don't know who are you trying to call. My name is Engelbert Humperdinck. Have a good day. I'm going to have you reported you. to the FCC. Do you understand? It's no joke. But, 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 but don't start it now. Wayne COVID, how can I help you? Hey, what's going on? Jerk off. Hello? Identify yourself. Uh, this is Winko Foods. Really? Yes, it really is. Is your mama around? Oh, my God, really? Maybe she'll suck your cock uh, for you. Maybe she would. Maybe she would do that for you. Why don't you call your mother right now and have her suck that cock? And guess what? Oh! 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 Thank you for calling Food Front. How can I help you? Get yourself an attorney. Sorry? I'm going to have you reported to the FCC. Do you understand? Identify no, yourself. Don't. Nah, that's cool. Not, not until you do it first. My name is Engelbert Humperdinck. Uh-huh. So what are, you, what are you reporting me for? I'm going to have you reported to the FCC. Do you understand? All right. I'm a legal firm, and you better watch what you're doing. Okay, I look forward to it. Now, as far as, as, far as your, your, your profanity about wanting to suck cock... Oh, okay. Why don't you call your mother right now and have her suck that cock? Okay. Maybe she'll suck your you, cock you, for you. Is your mama around? Maybe, maybe you should do it. I've got issues with the idiot that she gave birth to. That'd be you. You mean you? You better watch what you're doing. It's no joke. All right, man. I've, this is uh, this is fun, but I gotta go. You know you are being recorded. And guess what? Eight inches. <laughs> okay. Trader Joe's Clackamas. This is Ashley. Gregory Stevens. Trader Joe's Clackamas. This is Ashley. Hey, what's going on? May I ask who's calling? Uh huh. My name is Engelbert Humperdinck. <sighs> Jerk off. <laughs> wow. Florence Grocery Outlet, how can I direct your call? Hey, what's going on? Not much. Is your mama around? My mom. Did the Sheriff's Department yeah. serve your court summons, dirtbag? Excuse me? You have Grocery Outlet. I'm going to have you reported to the FCC. Do you understand? Jerk off. Hello? It's no joke. I have no idea who you are, sir. Just a moment. Let me get you to somebody that can help you. Gregory Stevens. This is Mike. Can I help you? My name is Engelbert Humperdinck. Identify yourself. This is Mike. Can I help you? Really? Corvallis Market of Choice. This is Leslie Humming. I direct your call. Hey, what's going on? Hello. Did the Sheriff's Department serve your court summons, dirtbag? Hmm? Get yourself an attorney. I'm calling you out. Do you want me to transfer you to one of my managers? Yes. Okay, one second. And guess what? It's no joke. Thanks for holding. This is Mike. I may help you. Just to let you know, this phone call is being recorded. Okay. What's your name? Identify yourself. Good afternoon, Service Deli. How may I help you? Hello? Hello, Service Deli. I'm just going to give you my opinion. Do you want my opinion? Are you talking to me? Yes. Okay. You 
strike me as... Whole Foods Grocery, this is Andrew. Hello? Yeah, Whole Foods Grocery, this is Andrew. How's it going? Hi, good. Good. What can I help you with? Well, let me ask you something. Mm-hmm. You know what? Nobody really cares about groceries. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, um, can I help you find something? Yes. I deserve groceries better than this. Yes or no? Um, I'm sorry, is there a product I can help you find? You got one answer, and it's either yes or no. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, can I... Can I help, is there a product I can help you find? Yes. We have a report that the young man says that you rubbed his groceries. I'm sorry. I'm not sure I understand. Um, can I connect you with our customer service department? You understand what I'm saying? No, I'm sorry. I don't. Can I connect you with customer service? Yes. Yeah, give me one second. Hurry up. Whole Foods, customer service. This is Alice. Hi. What can I do? This is Fred. How are you? Good. Okay. Do you remember me? No, I do not. Let's start this again. My name is Fred Herbert. Okay. I'm wondering what you're you're doing. I'm working at Whole Foods right now. I went to an AA meeting just yesterday. I got 25 years since I drank, and I was the worst drunk. Well, I'm. That's good. How long have you been on the job? Since October. Wow. Would you like a department? Is that right? Or would you like Excuse to talk me? to anyone in a certain department here? Or? Yes. Carol. Where does that person work? Karen. No. Carrie. I'm not sure who. Joan. No. Lawrence. I'm sorry, sir. I don't think who Richard. you talk to is here. John Beck. No. Kyrie. I think you might. I think you might got, have gotten the wrong number. Oh. <laughs> is that right? Possibly. I, I apologize. Me. Oh, that's okay. It's beyond All my right, comprehension. Yeah, have a good day, sir. Huh? Have a good day. Hang on. Okay. So you want to know what the Bellbine business is all about? No, that's okay. Thank you. Have a good day. Say yes. Whole Foods customer service. This is Liz. How may I help you? Say again, sir. Whole Foods customer service. Carol? Whole Foods. This is Whole Karen? Foods Grocery Store. Hi. So what's going on? Whole, uh, this is Whole Foods. What do you need? Is that right? It's beyond my comprehension. Whole Foods. This is Miss Childs. Are you do you remember me? I need to get a hold of someone for you? Yes. Go ahead. What? Do you need some assistance? Do you need the... Do you need medics at your home yes. or something like that? Yes. You do? This is regarding... No, just fine. You're just fine? Yes. You keep dialing the same number and you're calling... Uh, I apologize. That's okay. If you need assistance, you need to dial 911, okay? You called me. I We did not call you, so... I've been. I've had 30 calls today... From, and and uh, that I'm calling somebody. I'm not calling anybody. Okay, you're, we the, our phone rang on this end. So if you do need help, though, you need to call nine one one. Okay, sir. Yes. Yes, you need to call nine one one. Okay. Thank you, Ron. Okay. Thank Bye. you very much. Goodbye. Whole Foods. This is Alice. Mister Stanfield. Do you have okay. big what is your, what, Sir, what is your number? 
It's been a mystery to me. Can you give me your number, sir? Hang on. The number is 909-595-2264. That's what it is. 909? Yeah. 909? Yeah. 595-2264? Yeah. Yes. What's your name, sir? My name is Fred name? Herbert. This is Fred. Um, do you live in Bend, Oregon? Yes. Every day. Do you have? Do you know your address, sir? Uh huh. What's your 147 address? One forty-seven North Euclid Avenue and upward. Is that right? Thirty. You tell me. What's your address, sir? Am I right? I don't know. What's your address? You tell me. 435 West Mission Boulevard in Pomona. Hmm. You heard me. Hmm. Do you remember what's me? Your address in, what, what's your address in Bend, sir? 147 North Euclid Avenue and upward. What is the, what is the name of the street again? Trump Towers, Suite One Hundred and Five. <laughs> okay. Um. All right. I, I I'm apologize. Hang up now, okay. Oh. All right. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act? Hmm. So I'm gonna. So your number is nine zero nine five nine five two two six four. Correct. Yes. What number okay. are you calling from? I'm not calling for you, sir. You're calling us. Maybe you should be more prepared for this call. Okay. Well, you have a good day. Don't call your house anymore. Okay. Well, good. Thank you. Are you on some special phone? He's off his freaking rocker. That's it. He is. Service, service. Service. Hello? Hello? You need, you need something? You're starting to make me wonder here. Hello? I've got a strange call that keeps coming through from a... Dick? I've got a firearm constantly.